Okay, so the objective in this video is to learn how to make a rotating door, uh, Minecraft style, of course. There are many door tutorials, but I'm guessing for those who are watching these videos, probably just want to make these doors. So I'm going to go ahead and recreate it. Um, we're going to use the block tool, create a block. 4x40 four seems to work decently. I'm going to go ahead and look for the Minecraft door texture. I'm going to press enter, which creates it. Oh, the texture is going to be a little off. We are going to fix the texture and change this to 3125. And there we go. And we're also going to, for my sakes, so we're going to don't have to flip it. I like to flip it though because that's the way a lot of the doors look in Minecraft. If you've noticed, handle's always right there. Anyway, okay, so now we have the door, we need to create it a function. So control T, bring up this window, function door rotating. Apply. We're going to name this door one just for kicks. And this is going to leave everything else. Next thing we're going to edit is the speed. I kind of like 200, maybe 225. Personal preference, really. Um, we are also going to choose a sound. There are Minecraft sounds that you can find if you want to, but just for now, we're just going to use regular Half-Life sounds. So we're going to do door. Oops. That didn't work. My bad. No, where is it? There's one. It's for the open and for the close. Start close sound. I'm gonna use type in door. We'll use that one. We'll close three. And this is, it'll, after four seconds, it'll close by itself. Um, we don't want it to be always closed. We want it to spawn on the map already closed. If you want it to be already open, you can do that. But if you want it to be already closed, we'll have it there. And everything else looks good. Now, on the, under flags, we want to make this, if you want to make it a one-way door, that's fine. However, Minecraft obviously doesn't have that. We're going to use use on opens. Toggleable is if you don't want it to be four seconds until it closes, it just opens and closes by itself. I kind of like it when it opens by itself, or it closes by itself. Um, and I think we just want it to be like that. It looks fine. So we're going to press apply. Now, something else other important, also important. Why is my mouse disappearing like this? Mouse is acting up. Anyway, I also want to move this little point right here. We need to move this right there. See how it's on the last block of the edge? This edge, this is the edge that it'll be rotating around. And we want it to rotate in this direction. So we move this little guy. See how it's already there in that direction? If we were, have it, see how it moves as I move this? We want it to rotate perfectly. So we have that. We had zero. So this is zero, 90, 180, 270. We're gonna have it at zero right now. And I think we are good to go here. Now I did forget there are textures that need to be applied to the edge of the door. Um, forgot about this. Uh, let's go ahead and look at the edges, see what they look like. They look kind of weird, honestly. I'm not quite sure what texture they would use for this side of the door. Let's see. I guess we can just use... Let's use this texture, I suppose.
Just something that looks Minecrafty. We'll leave that. Oh, we gotta fix this one. It just looks kind of nasty. I'll put it back. Right there. I don't know. Not, not many people will see that anyway. I mean, you can be really picky about that. I'm just showing you how to make the regular door. So, we are going to be complacent with that for now. Put that there. And we should be good. Let's go ahead and load the map. Alright, so the map has loaded. Let's go ahead and check out our door. There we go. I guess since things we could you do to make it better, you can tweak the speed of the door. Find your own door sounds. Obviously, sometimes that door sound doesn't work. If we were to make it toggleable, we could close it while it's open. Though the four second thing sometimes is useful, sometimes it's not useful. You take your pick. I like it toggleable because then after you open it, you can just close it by yourself. However, it does stay open otherwise. But, alright, that's how you make a door.